uh, the question from uh, Andusa. It says, uh, maybe you have already answered this. Sorry for taking you behind. I join late. What if you are a single mom and comes to the United States for the very first time? How can you go successful? How can how can how can you go successful to the nursing program? Ah, that's the whole story. It's my story because I'm a single mom. I was a single mom before even I become a nurse. So it's a process, but you can still do it. Like you just like like like, like we were talking about the childcare. You just try if you come here, then you are a single mom. You have you. There is help out there. You can ask for help, government assistance. There is so many programs that they can help you to become who you are. For maybe you go to my uh, as you, uh, my my page, then she can um, if it's she or he ask me specific like where or if she's still here or she's in Africa or whatever she is. I can tell her where to go. Also, maybe when we're done, she can listen to the interview because we explain in detail from the beginning it's, it's going to take a long time to explain again yeah the, the, if she's healing she can go to my channel and remember we talk about some stuff yes for Haley too yes in, yeah okay. if you go if you go to the this uh youtube channel uh okay. then if you speak swahili there is a full interview just about that yeah yeah there's another related question about the uh, uh, not a single mother particular, but uh, how do you balance your busy work schedule with the family life? Uh, it's not easy. It's hard, but I'm a single mom, so it's just me and my son. So it's the day I have to go to work, since I work days now, my son will be going to school in the morning until 3. He gets home at 3, but I get home at 7. So when I get home, I I, make, I call him. I make sure, like, do you have homework? He does his homework. I the days I'm off, I make sure he I have some food in the house. Or oh, sometimes, now we have what do you call this air fryer, or he knows how to make some stuff. He's old enough now to fix himself some stuff if he's hungry, make himself some sandwich. So I make sure I have food in the house and. That's how I do, and if maybe he has some programs, like maybe the, around the time they used to have basketball, if I'm off, then I'm there for for him. But if I'm not, and his dad takes him. But I try my best. I cannot be there for everything, but I try to do whatever I'm available. I, that's how I do it. Someone is making a comment, Maulai, I'd say America is a great country by people. A nurse making... 10,000 US dollar a month and above. Wow. <laughs> hard work. You gotta work hard for it, but you can do it. Yeah. Uh, Nantume Esther is saying, can someone who studied something else like agriculture join STNA uh, when they come to America? Yeah, you can. Yep. You can do whatever you want. Come there from your country, wherever you are, with a different degree and come here, you want to change completely. You can do it. There is no limit. Only the sky is the limit. They say you can do anything. The good, that's a good thing about America. Like even if you study, maybe your background was arts, whatever. You come here, you change your mind. You know what? I want to become a doctor. You can do it. There's no limit. Yeah.